Hello everybody and welcome back. Let me scoot the bike back to <laughs> Mass Effect. Not Mass Effect. Dang freak. I had that one's gonna happen too. I've been playing Mass Effect uh, 2 Legendary Edition. Um, Mass mm, <laughs> Horizon Forbidden West. Okay, <laughs> now that we've got that over with, uh, welcome back. We're gonna... We're gonna... Don't, don't see me please, for the love. Come on, come on over. Come on over. These otters are adorable. Sorry, I was gonna... <laughs> I was gonna take a picture for my friend because he his he got the hard copy version of Horizon Zero Dawn and I got the digital version so I get to play it first. I also don't live in rural Montana or North Dakota or wherever it is <laughs> that he's at. So hey, <laughs> um, I was gonna take a picture, but I already took a different picture of it. Of for no, I wanted to no. Okay, can I just? Can I just? Can I just re- I'm in- hang on. hang on, let's see. No, I can't save. <sighs> yeah, no, I'm gonna just- I'm gonna be sneaky. I prefer being sneaky in this game, especially when I'm playing on hard mode. to have you know what you know what you know what while I am thinking of it I'm not a general uh, cool, not quite waypoint e receive markers on screen to help you reach dynamic dynamic contextual Uh, weapon wheel slow down. Dang. Auto chewing. Oh, that's right. We get this is this is. <laughs> I know people always compare games to Breath of the Wild, um, Dark Souls, and oh, what's that other one? Anyway, people. This isn't like a running joke right now in games journalism that people are always comparing things to like a, well like standard games even if they're not always. <laughs> they're like it's like Dark Souls except nice and uh, etc. Oh my gosh, look at now I can see this rock art better in the background and I can see the mo the uh, like was it the grazer motif maybe. Um, oh my gosh. I wish I could actually look at this in real life. Oh my gosh, if I can find re if I can find rock art in this game, I might lose my mind. I spent like a month and a half this last summer because I live nomadically generally. Just right now for work, I've been pretty... Um, they've been putting us up in a hotel. Um, but I generally live nomadically, and I've spent like a month and a half in 2021 uh, running around southern Utah looking for rock art. And it was super duper duper cool. Co-pilot! What? Turn this feature on. Use a second controller with mirrored controls. Requires a second. You can play with somebody. Oh my gosh. Is this technically a co-op game? Could Varl play with me? Or like if somebody wanted to play Varl, could they play Varl? But this is mirrored controls. So like what would we just be doing like... Or would we both controlling Aloy? Oh my gosh. I don't know if I want wait let's just let's try this for now. HUD visibility. Oh custom. Dynamics fine right now. Let's actually let's 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 try one at a time. Guided waypoint finding. Which I think is technically when I put a waypoint down. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. So, otherwise it wouldn't show up? Is that what it's telling me? I don't know. It's whatever. I would like to be able to... Unless the game doesn't let you, but I would like to be able to have these up constantly like they were in Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh jeez, <laughs> I got distracted. Oh. Ew. 
in Horizon Zero Dawn, you had to hold down the, the button for rocks and then throw them, like, by pressing the left trigger, but this time you just have to, like, load it into your hand. Come on over. Come, come on. I wish I had the whistle. That was a lot more effective. I keep trying to load the rock and then throw it, but it's not. I'll figure this out. I'll figure it out. I literally have been playing Horizon Zero Dawn for days. For, for months. For weeks. So forgive me if I'm... <laughs> I'm trying to remember or trying to learn new controls while feeling like this game is very familiar. Machines patrolling ahead. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. Sneaky one. Oh my gosh, look at it climbing. How am I, what am I supposed to do if it won't come over here? Can it see me? Oh my gosh, can it see me? Oh my gosh. Some of them had scanning functions in the previous game. Oh my gosh, it's so cute, look at it. Come over here. Come down here. Freaking heck. They're so cute though, I'm so sad. I love, okay, these little X's must be like, you can't climb that or something, I don't know. But it's amazing. Is there a third one? There's usually three. Oh, I see you. The other one's hiding, apparently. Could I get... I was trying to see if I could climb anything. How far away can you see me from? That one looks like I should be okay. Just don't turn around. Oh man, fire arrows are my favorite, so I don't know if I want to use all this blast paste, unless we get blaze back, and blaze and blast paste are different. I love it when enemies can't see your companion, I'd be really peeved if they could. <laughs> you gonna come out? No? Okay. Can you see me? Did I search the other one? I, uh, uh, I did. Oh, 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 oh. That's the same one we've been... Yeah, the scrounger. 
chain reaction. Love that when those happen. Attack removal, destroyed when kid. Oh, so some of these things, okay, some of these things you have to knock off in order to get them or they'll be destroyed when it's killed. I can detach with my spear, I think, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh wait, let's see. What's your path? Oh, coming right next to us. How nice. How nice for us. Let me just nope, I don't I'm coward. It might get close enough right here actually for me to just silent strike it. Oh, but I think I was saying earlier, I have to remember that um This isn't like my easy baby mode game. Where I'm just trying to get the DLC. Okay. How to get out of here. And so I have it literally on story mode. I don't I don't care. I just wanna I literally just wanna play the DLC for the story. Although there are supposed to be some pretty machine cool right through the wall. Pretty cool machines. To fight. There's a ladder in the back. Oh, that's hard to see. Okay. I was curious if... See, this this is what kind of messes me up, is sometimes, like, well, always, the little codex entry stuff looks very much like that stuff. What the... Oh. Did that. What's in here? Nothing. Ancient wreath, ancient ring. Which one's which? You'll never know. Unless I look in the inventory. Is that climbable? No. Varl, help me up. I'm just checking to see if there was anything I could jump on. Um, where did you say? Oh, okay. Mm. Trying to be cool. Trying to be cool. Fire on the move. This game feels like it handles better. Like maybe, maybe I just didn't have my like my controller. So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands. As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow uh -huh. you. Uh-huh. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Mm. Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. Yeah. Tough moms. My mom is not like that, but I get it. <laughs> How do I get up there? Um. Can I... Wait, uh... I assume it would like showcase itself to me if I could do. She walks so funny with it, like <laughs> the way she's walking. Whoa. Oh, but yes, I was saying earlier. I remember now. I was saying something about um the the glider thing that we apparently are gonna get. These blue flowers keep messing me up. Um. Like Breath of the Wild. Woo. Oh, here we go. Let me in. But this game handles better. I don't know if it's just I had my controller sensitivity set up weird before or what. But... Um, it feels like it handles a lot better this time in this game, which is nice. Spaceship. Snake! Two, three, three snake? Three of those things? What? Yeah. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. Too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. 
convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That's ex- That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. What? Aloy? No. Trust me. And there she goes. She does need to get over to the shuttle to figure out how to make it fall uh, to the basin. I think one of the things that, that they were saying that Aloy has to learn how to do is learn how to depend on people. Like learn how to depend on friends. Not just um you know, going it on her own. She's ye needs to learn to get to the tower. I should be able to find a way to learn how to trust. And like not just do everything on her own. Untag it. Man, this messed me up. I should be able to sneak. Yet that makes me very sad. Oh, hello, another one. Oh, my gosh, I was trying to silent strike it while I was in focus mode, and that wasn't working. But luckily, I managed to get the silent strike off. Come on out. Oh boy. They're so cute. I have like a half second. Yeah, I should stick to my feet for now. Yeah. Save some ammo. Like, uh -huh. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay, interesting. Now we have a third attack. Also, they're like, we want you to learn how to use the spear. I know we focused on the bow last time, but use your spear now. Okay. It's usually easier to see them through walls, I feel like. I feel like maybe things are a little crowded right now. Maybe it'll be better when it's humans. Peppers. I grew some of these in my garden, and I was one of those 2020 garden people. I, I got whatever was, it was like May, like late May, and I got whatever little partially grown plants that the that the nursery had in stock and I planted them and the only there. thing that didn't survive that can get me up to the tower was my zucchini weirdly enough usually zucchinis are very prolific <laughs> but everything else survived oh there we go this is going to be new need oh come on Can I climb on this stuff? I don't even know where the shuttle is. Oh, okay. there's a rail up there. I, I forget. I have launched myself off that grapple point. I have upward mobility now. 
I don't want to drop, I want to climb. Unless I have to. I'm confused. I assume I could jump up to that. I'm, I'm confused. Top, tap, O before reaching a grapple point to launch into the air. I have to launch. Oh, nope, that didn't work. I didn't get up high enough. I better try this again. I am. I don't know when you. the rail up there if I launch myself off the rail. I don't know what you want. I'm pressing O. Tap. Oh no, I'm pressing square. I can't read. Got it. I just can't read. I was like, it better let me climb on both sides if it's a two sided ladder thing. You know what this kind of reminds me of, too, is, um, in the, sorry, in the, like, Mayan jungles, in the Mexican jungles, like, with the Mayan ruins, where, like, every, like, not everything, so, it's an extremely prolific jungle, right, and it, to the point where, like, it's grown over most of everything that, like, once was there, like, all these ruins, right, and for a long time, people thought that it was just dotted with these hills, that it was just a hilly environment. Turns out, when they finally could do, like, what is it, like, aerial scanning or, like, some sort of sonic scanning, again, I'm a terrible archaeologist, um, but <laughs> they revealed that those were actually temples. They were, there was temples everywhere more than people expected um, or thought was in the area because they were so completely covered by foliage that you could no longer discern what they were. They thought they were part of the natural environment. That's what this kind of looks like, is especially with like the shape. I'm sure that's very intentional, right? With like the slope, like ziggurat kind of shape. I think that's the right word. Again, I'm a bad archeologist. It could be the wrong word. I apologize. <laughs> Can I climb on that? Yes. Anyway, that's what it reminds me of, is our our civilization being slowly- oh, that sounds good overcome by the jungle. So all along, there were three giant machines killing Osiru and leaving acid everywhere. <sighs> Great. Oh boy. The storm's getting bad. Uh, double tap at, at, double tap X. <laughs> Uh-uh. Wait, I don't think I can make that jump. I think I can make this jump. Oh my goodness gracious. See look look look. You see, the, you see the shape? It's one rickety tower down. On to the next. Very intentional. Also, what were these? What, what was, Maybe I can ride it to the, other what was side. the thing the snakes were attacking? Uh... Oh! Wow. What did you want me to do? It oh. didn't tell me to do anything. I assumed she was gonna catch herself. <laughs> Are you serious? I assumed she was gonna catch herself. What the heck? <laughs> I'll be able to make that jump. They didn't- there was no prompt. There was no prompt that came up that I saw. Like, you want me to- Okay. <laughs> what the heck? That was- that was dumb. That's what I get for having a dynamic HUD, I guess. I don't know. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I bet there's a control console nearby. Mm. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall right into the basement. It is funny, even for a video game protagonist, I feel like Aloy talks out loud to herself a lot. And I think somebody once pointed out that it's probably because she spent a lot of her life <laughs> with nobody else to talk to but herself. And Rost, technically, which is the argument I always bring up. I'm like, she had Rost, it's not like she was totally alone. But she did have to learn how to play by herself, right? And, uh, and she had the little... 
She had the thing, the focus to keep her company, and that's it. Man, they're breaking things. I know it's like it was really cool in the last game, <laughs> how like uh, like bellowbacks and stuff when they were fighting you would like um break like foliage, like like break the trees and stuff like that. Also, they, they look like otters, and they're like they burrow in the ground, and I'm like I don't know how I feel about that. Those guys are the mean ones. The not cute ones, the ones that look like scrappers. And I don't have Varl here to help me, which honestly would be really nice in playing on hard mode, having a friend. First achievement. Oh, also, dang it, I meant to mention in the very first video, but uh, maybe I did and I just forgot already, but that I platinumed Horizon Zero Dawn and it was the first game I ever platinumed. Uh, I, and I don't play my PlayStation a ton, I really only got it for Horizon Zero Dawn and then also I thought The Last of Us, but I never played The Last of Us. <laughs> okay. Or God of War. Time to crush those machines down below. But I mostly wanted to play Horizon Zero Dawn, and I did. This could have repercussions on, like, the structural integrity of the whole area. Spaceship. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. And often, oh. now how to get up the tower? I think I think this is not good. Um. Also, structural integrity. But Standing with my focus. Before I forget my thought, um, <laughs> having. Aloy talk out loud is in most video games I think um, generally they'll give you somebody to talk to like over your headset or something <laughs> but Aloy doesn't have anybody to talk to not in a headset anyway not anymore not with Silence gone which also I'm really hoping um, that I can get to the DLC before too long into this game because I know that the DLC has some good Silence lore and because I think he's Banook. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> Before we do anything else crazy, like st structural integrity warnings anymore. Any that was in English. I can't speak. Um. Anyway, um. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Rescalito, my sapling tier patron, and Christopher, my tree tier patron thank you so much for being the super bestest <laughs> thank you both again for all your support and all the rest of you for your support i appreciate it and i hope to see you in the next video